Good morning, beautifuls. I'm Char. You are in the Daily Task for Happiness playlist, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So this year, I have dedicated to sharing a video with you every single day um, regarding the tasks that I use to get myself happy, to raise my vibration, to do all those wonderful things that the gurus say, to raise our level of consciousness, to raise our vibration, to get out of a place of depression and into a place of happiness. And these are just little steps that you can do intentionally every day that'll help raise that vibration up. Now, a lot of people, they talk about, oh, go raise your vibration, do a meditation or do this or do that. And a lot of people don't really explain how that is done. So welcome to the Daily Task for Happiness. By doing these little tasks every day, you will make little steps in your in your life to become happier. It has worked for me. I have come from very, very depressed, grieving state of mind to a very um, content and happy place in my life. And that is, excuse me, going to take me right to where our topic is today. A lot of times we feel pressure from medias about bigger, better, flashier, the dream vacation, the dream car, the dream life, the dream home. What if your dream isn't that? What if your dream is to have an average life? What if your dream is to have enough, to be comfortable, to enjoy the little things? What if your dream is to have a beautiful balance in your life where you can enjoy your work and your friends and your family? What if your dream is just to be average? Right? Have you ever stopped to think about that? Have you ever stopped to think that my average life, I am so happy with that. It is okay to be average. It is okay to want average things. It is okay to strive to be average. <laughs> and the reason I talk about this is because as we make a shift in our consciousness, as we're raising our vibration, as we're striving to be a better person, a better human, and understand more and become more connected with our faith and the universe and and god right like ultimately we're on a seeking mission in our lives um to always keep learning but i want you to understand i want you to understand something so very important and i read a blog post about this probably like eight or nine years ago that really really changed my perspective and wanting an average life is okay and I think 2020 has really shown us that where things are important, it's not the material stuff. It's the stuff that's within us. It's the stuff that we can share with our friends and family. It's how we feel and how we contribute to our lives, to our communities, to our economies, to our systems, right? So sometimes it's overwhelming when you have the media going, you need to travel, you need to buy, you need to have, you need to beat, you need to do better than. And there's not enough encouragement of, of saying, you know what, way to go. If you're happy in your life and you're doing what you want to do and you're comfortable and this is where you want to be, then congratulations. That didn't come out right. Congratulations. Um, I just wanted to remind you really, really, really how important it is to just set your own personal goals, to set your own personal standards, to set your own personal boundaries. And if you are seeing somebody else and they're like, go for greatness, do this, be rich, be wealthy, be famous, be all this. And that's not for you. Then good. Don't do that. <laughs> it is not for you. And it's okay to not want that. I don't want that. In my goals for life, I don't want to be a world traveler. I don't want to go and do all that stuff. I want to be a fulfilled human being. I want to help other people. I want to feel good about what I'm doing. I want to keep learning. And those are my goals. And for me, that big lofty, I'm not big on the world travel. I never have been. You know, I love traveling within my country. Um, so really, really, really watch what is influencing you there. And just keep in mind, whatever your goals are for you that works for you is perfect. And wanting an average life is completely acceptable. So happy Friday. I thought I would just come and talk about that for a little while because there is a lot of pressure on bigger, better and whatnot. And I, I contribute to that as well. But that is because in my own personal life, I am striving to do 
more. I'm striving to be a better human. I'm striving to be more for myself. Um, so I have, I've strived, striven. I have worked to have um, an attitude of abundance. I have worked to get myself out of a place of lack and into a place of comfort. And my place of comfort is so completely average. And I am so completely happy with that. All right, you guys. So there is just um, something to keep in mind on our road to happiness, doing these little things every day to keep us in check. Um, comparison is a real big happiness killer. So just remember, you don't have to go for lofty goals. And if you're comfortable and you're happy with what you're doing, then bless you. That is so wonderful. And congratulations on achieving your goals and what you want to do. I'm going to leave it here. Happy Friday. I love you guys so very much. I hope your day is amazing. And I will see you again tomorrow in our daily task for happiness.